Hi guys, how are you doing? Welcome to my YouTube channel. Welcome to my YouTube channel. If this is your first time on my channel, make sure to hit the subscribe button before leaving or before continuing to watch this video. And if this is not your first time on my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. You guys are a darling. Anyways, so today's video is a bit different from every other videos that I've done uploaded on my um, channel. So today is actually an unboxing um, day basically an unboxing video I'm gonna be unboxing some of the PR products um, that I got from brands and you know I just wanted to do it on camera and show you guys um, some of them I would be doing like a separate video for each of them but I just wanted to show you for each brand rather but I just wanted to show you guys everything because like I'm excited anyway so um if you wanna um if you wanna if you want to see some of the products that I got um, from brands, then keep on watching. And if you don't want to watch or see the products, make sure to subscribe before leaving shy. Anyways, um, yeah, let's get started. Yeah. Okay, so the first brand that I got items from is um, Brand Beauty. Brand Beauty is a Nigerian brand here in Nigeria. And they make um, lashes, lipsticks, lip liners. Uh, I think that's about it. Yeah, those are the products that I've seen so far. And anywho, so they sent me some of their products to, you know, they just sent it to me. So I'm doing a review. I'm gonna do a review rather. So and these are the lashes that I got. I got um, six pairs of lashes. And I really like the packaging, rather than I had to struggle with most of them, as you can see here. But every other thing is just perfect. I like the stuff that um, caption at the back. A woman and her lashes have an endless love affair. I don't know if you can see it. But yeah, and this is Brand Beauty. This is the logo. Um, so five pairs of lashes, one lipstick, and two lip liners. So let's start off with the lashes. So um, this is the first pair, and it's in the style Soul Tree. I'm going to be doing a separate video, so make sure to check the description box so you can get a link to each of the brand um, reviews. So I just want to show you guys quick. Um, you know, of course, I'm going to do a more detailed one. This is Dash. I really like this because it's simple and it feels like you can literally wear it with anything and it feels so, so soft. And one thing I like about her brand and lashes are that they come with like a thick band. I know that a lot of um, lash brands these days are coming with thick bands as well. So, But this is basically, it's coily lashes friendly. Um, the next style I got is Roxy. Roxy looks like Dash but I think it's a lot thicker as you can see. Mm. Then next is Bloom. Bloom is like a very full, if you're going for like a very full you know look and all that stuff and it feels really soft. Oh that's another thing I forgot to add. Her lashes are lightweight. That when you wear them it doesn't feel like you're wearing anything. Um, there are some lashes that I've actually worn that were, that felt so heavy. Actually, a lash work. Like, guys, you need, you need to try. So this is Bliss. Um, almost the same length as Dash. No, sorry, as uh, the second one before the last one. And it looks like this. Um okay then we have finally ruby ruby is my favorite um can you see why it is like it's so full and sexy and everything so i really like this one uh and i think that's it with the lashes so the only issue i have though you know i said i was struggling with the packaging because it's i don't know but um i really like it i just feel I mean, you saw the length, the size of the lashes, they were like this way, so this whole part was unnecessary, but I think it was because of our logo that she kept it, so that's fine with me. Now, to the lipsticks, lip liners, 
I got um, one in Juicy and another one in Gorange. So, and this is what they look like. So let's start off with Juicy. Juicy is a dark, is it dark red? Yeah, so this is what they look like when they come out of their boxes, packaging rather. And if you open it, it looks like this. Um, so Juicy is a dark purple. Just wanted to show you guys a quick swatch. Can you see? Yeah, it's, oh sorry, like a dark purple red. Please pardon my, I was using my hand to swatch some products, but this is what it looks like. It's a dark purple with like a red on that tone. So that's juicy. Um, next is Gorange. Gorange is like a red orange on that tone. This is what it looks like, of course. And I like that it's super creamy, so it's going to be so easy to work with. So it's like a red with like a bit of orange, but like pure red. So I thought it, I was going to be seeing like orange. And I was asking myself, who uses orange lips, lipsticks these days? But yeah, it's red and not orange. But it has like a, an un, a quiet undertone of orange. But it's red. So these are the swatches for the lipstick. Um, for the lip liners rather so I also got a lipstick um, and this is in the shade Rich Bell this is what the packaging looks like so let's see and this is the lipstick it's a pink lipstick can you see let me just show you a swatch I really like it and it dries matte when it dries matte it looks like this okay, no. yeah it looks like this and that's our own care lipstick in adore so, but this is a really pretty pink and i don't have a pink lipstick so this is so good next is a lip gloss it's called sugar hard candy and the packaging of her lip glosses look like this so let's open it and see so and this is it's a shimmery pink purple ish i really love this one um can you see it's so pretty okay um yeah that's it with the Vam Beauty. So the next package I got, which was the next day, was Ewarunke. And you guys know that I love this brand. So I got the Ewarunke um, package. And she recently launched some products. Um, her pigment, uh, dual, dual reflectors. I need, I need to clean this stuff. Mm -hmm. Dual reflectors. And they're like uh, pigments, but with dual reflection. And then, I don't know if you understand it reflects two colors do you get and this are the products I think I have to. so I got liners this is the brow perfect it looks like this oh I forgot to it's like the beauty line by Didi it's a brow pencil <laughs> retractable brow pencil and then it has a cute spoon hmm. nice um this is the kaja eyeliner it's black and it's called eye tech gel pen liner cleopatra can you see oh so like it's really black i really like it my mom wanted to take it from me but and this is the eyeline hair in blackout i really love this one because it has like a very thin um Deep. can you see so and it dries matte and it's not easy to get off so it's like completely matte um next I got lipsticks this is in the shade so I got um 
six yeah six lipsticks so let's start this is punk punk is a dark purple can you see it's a dark purple i really like this ombre lips it's gonna be helpful next is burning love my favorite it's red like this red is gorgeous and let's do a quick swatch can you see okay next we have gleaded 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 is a metallic lipstick and it's a gold one mm, looking forward to this Fancy. Next we have Caravel. Caravel is a dark. Um, I'm still trying to figure out the shade, but it's like a dark red. Can you see? Okay, it's actually a dark red. But I feel like it has like black that makes it a bit off but it's a really pretty dark red so you can use this to line your lips and then use burning love at the center of your lips next we have adore like this was the shade i was telling you about it's quite um okay no i think um van beauty's rich belt is lighter <laughs> this is adore it's like a dark purple sorry dark pink can you see Next we have rose brown. Rose brown is a nude color. <laughs> I love, 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 love this. So this is what it looks like. It's a nude color. Uh, there was also a lip gloss. It's called Stripped. And it looks like this so pretty let me show you this stripped hmm. to me it smells nice <laughs> it smells nice to me <laughs> so um i think that's it with the lip glosses next i have our latest addition to our brand which are these reflectors <laughs> and i don't waste them because they come in very little quantity inside so i will be showing you guys this when i'm doing like the swatch for this brand so next is this okay so let me tell you a little story about this i got this from beauty connoisseurs on instagram i'm gonna leave a handle on like in the description box so you know um i think she was doing like a giveaway for the latest for the new um rebranded beauty line by i'm sorry flawless ivy foundation and you know i just showed the interest in the comment section that, oh i really like this and i mentioned the shade i would like and you know she now sends me a, a dm that ah that babe how far i'm gonna try to leave a screenshot of the of the message if not i think that's private but let's see i, I might do that um that's oh i i was planning to send you a package for all the slaying you did last year oh my god i was blushing because you know those are the kind of people that i need more not people that are just there monitoring your instagram they don't like they don't comment they don't do anything so it's a bit annoying which reminds me i just completed a giveaway on my page i also gave the most supportive instagram followers so that's what i want to be doing more often we appreciating those that are really you know engaging on my platform on my page rather so and she was like oh okay me in my head i was like oh maybe she was just whining me so ah, next day she asked me for my address i was like what you know how people tell you they want to give you this and 
eventually they won't give it to you so i don't bother when they say oh i want to send you this i was like oh thank you thank you thank you <laughs> but i didn't know she was serious and um you know, i sent her my address and even before that i wanted to get like a pallet but she didn't have that in stock and with that long story short she sent me a package so um you know i told you i wanted to get a pallet but she didn't have it so i went ahead and ordered it on jumia um but i also paid for some products which are also part of this i'm going to show you that but most of what is inside here are what she gave me for slaying in 2018 these guys go and learn from her eh i don't know what people are doing here you can't even say oh okay let us do this so anyways this is what the package looks like it's a lot like so let me start off with what items i paid for before so i there's an item actually missing i think she forgot to add that maybe in my next order or something but so these are items like paper these are disposable eyeliners uh, i got two of these i can't find the other one and this is 500 now on that page i tried using this but it seemed like a bit difficult to use but i don't know maybe it needs a lot of practice because the one i use doesn't have curved edges so i just felt that having curved edges is a, like a, an added plus because it's gonna be faster and all that but we'll see these are disposable liners and I got this foundation, Flawless Ivy Foundation, the tube one. I actually, my mom actually used it yesterday and she liked it. But I just kind of like rubbed it here and I didn't quite like it because it's not full coverage. Even though it said full coverage here. Like Nigerian brands, you guys need to do better. So anyways, uh, next. I think that's all I just paid for the, oh yeah and then the phone holder again this wasn't exactly the phone holder I wanted but I didn't specify that in her defense I didn't specify the phone holder so it's but I think I can still use this I actually wanted to get that for my fiance because he was always complaining about um, holding his phone and his phone is heavy so that, that the one I wanted was like a clip so you just kind of clip it on the table so he can clip the phone holder on the table and then place his phone and we can video chat and do all that stuff but um i guess i didn't specify so she gave me the um phone holder for ring lights for tripod and all that stuff but yeah this is the foundation the tweezer and the phone holder oh okay so let's start off with the palette <laughs> I'm so excited guys so she gave me the beauty creations splash of glitter and it's a bunch of glitters can you see all oh, this again this was an item she gave me I just showed you guys the items I paid for the ones I'm showing you guys now are what she gave me for slaying okay so these are all the glitters I really like this one and this one but this is this is just a lot i love it thank you girl so next um we have this palette the 28 color magic eyeshadow palette and the colors here are super gorge like jeez just see just look at this i initially thought they were all shimmy colors but we have like a good amount of matte colors it's so pretty so pretty now my um what is it called my eyeshadow collection is actually building up which is a nice thing so cool okay so um another palette she gave me was this elf i don't know how to pronounce it but i think this is like a I don't know but this is what it's called and the colors are so pretty can you see this try the gold I got chunky details I don't know why how they keep pouring 
but I'll try to fix that so my house is not glitter glitter everywhere like chunky glitters I've been wanting to buy this and it's so great that she gave me the palette so these are a bunch of like with different colors and you know my favorite is this 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 oh everything like but the one that really stood out to me is this one so I'm going to use that under my eyes that you would see that in a bit when I'm reviewing each of the brands but I really like them love rather um next she gave me some lashes like <laughs> yeah I'm, I'm in lash heaven and I really like this because they feel so light and fluffy so you can use them when you're doing like a natural look and oh yeah this is what I wanted to get next one when I get paid and they have the matte pigment matte pigment crazy pigmented you know when I say crazy pigmented I literally mean crazy pigmented so let's try it and show you so it looks like this I don't know if you can see it like this I'm just gonna swatch a couple of shades Ooh, like, uh, you would see like all the swatches so but this is what it looks like and these are all the colors I got um the pencil that I actually wanted this is the new one I was telling you about and it's so pretty and then the hush beauty um let's see oh I, I think this one is broken up so I basically can't use this because it's it broke yeah it broke that's the problem with most of these pencils and that's why I really like oh yeah this one has air breaking so you have to be very careful if not it breaks off and then your 2000 eyes a waste so she also gave me this um, brow and eyeliner pencil by Jordana it's brown like I already said and you can use this on your brow and um, yeah that's about it and that's it like just look at Oh, and yeah, it settles into the, like, your skin, as you can see. So you need to properly, what is it called, prime your eyelid and make sure that your eyelid is like a blank canvas because if, you're, if there's a crack in your eyelid, this will definitely pick up. Like, people would see that because it settles in. Can you see? So, but yeah, that's basically it with this video. I'm going to go ahead and do, apply my makeup and i'll show you guys um which i'll start reviewing each of the brands like in detail so check the description box so you don't miss that all right thank you so much for stopping by i love you guys bye